everyone. So we made it down to Indy. We got Bernie together. Hopefully all goes well today and we can get another win. April and my dad even made it. What are you called? <laughs> it's not the warmest. Today. I'm ready. Are you? Yeah, I'm going to do them today. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Yep, that'll work. I'm just gonna go for a little drive, see what's here. Let Bernie warm up. Get him, get him crispy. Nice and spicy. For the long few days, I appreciate all you guys supporting us and wanting to see us back out doing burnouts. So we're here, we're gonna try to put on a show. Try to get another win, we're ready. Indy's gonna be different. We'll go look at the pad here in just a little bit. Pulled up the tune-up to look over the rev limmer and stuff, and also wanted to look at the learn table from the last few burnouts. And everything's really good. I mean, look at all that 4%. There's a little bit of blue over here. Um, that's probably where it's tickling the limiter and stuff like that, kind of in this area. So just go ahead and leave it. Everything's looking pretty good. Ooh, Vargas. Rotary track, that thing's awesome. So now I think that rev limiter will be a bit better for this thing. And uh, we're gonna let it rip. There's the pit. Pretty cool, big grandstands here. So it looks like we're gonna have to enter in down low and then kind of come up into it. It's not a crazy incline, but it's gonna be a little bit. What in the world? <laughs> this is pretty cool. They just more or less flip the body on it and uh, drive it around. It's pretty pretty cool that it worked out that well. America car rips. It's on methanol. They did a good burnout at the last one, and then uh, they actually accidentally knocked the ignition switch. So he's back and ready to rip here again too. This truck sick. If you guys remember, well, it had the blower on it. Trying to get it back together here, ran in a few issues, but hopefully he gets it back together and we see him out there. I went ahead and set these all the way to tight and we're gonna go up to the front and set those. So QA1s are all set, test out this new suspension. We're gonna get the front set up. I had it at full tight. I'm actually gonna back it off just a little bit and get in here with the camera and uh, back it off. I think three clicks, so just the front's just a little bit looser. <laughs> Guys, that right there is the reason why we thrash to get the Bernie here and to do a burnout for the crowd because that's a big crowd. Motorsports is awesome. The burnout stuff is insane and that's that's something to see right there. Here we are. This will be the tip-in area. And it's actually almost about mid-pad. This will be slicked down here with the paint and everything. And it's a slight grade, not as bad as I thought. So we should be able to work this pretty good. Just you're gonna, the truck's gonna constantly wanna kind of fall towards this. So if we kind of work our way up towards the pad, come back down, I don't know. Last time we all talked about how I was gonna do it, it didn't go as planned. So I'm gonna go out there and just try to keep it off the wall. Maybe a wall cap towards the end if I'm able to squeeze it in. And we're just gonna send it. And hope for the best burnout. Get the tires off as quick as possible and see what we can do. competition happening first got a bunch of cars up here and back here check that out i don't know if that semi is going to do a burnout but that'll be pretty wild a lot of cool cars here the el cremino from demolition ranch is here so sick brent's gonna rip it in the mystery machine Woo, bernie made it so happy that bernie made it here to indy this crowd's amazing and i can't wait to rip it for him. that thing had three rear tires on it that's wild holy cow We've got the reverse truck too that'll be cool to see That's right. 
right way to do a reverse burnout. You guys are not disappointed. That was one hell of a show. That was insane. That was the longest burn. I just kept going. Well Send it to our best and hopefully get another W.
full run and blows the tire. So, James, let's see what you got, brother. Cheering it, everybody started like livening it up as yeah. I was doing that. that no, was, they were cheering. That they was were cheering. insane. That was so sick. She, like worked the path so well and it worked the crowd super well. That I mean, that couldn't have went better. So. It looked really good. The wheel speed was crazy. So how did the suspension feel? I mean, perfect. Yeah. Like the truck just stays consistent and smooth. Like it doesn't roll over. And like I, there was only one time that I was like, oh, I don't know if it's gonna go, and I turned. Right well, let's give a big thanks to QA1. <laughs> QA1 suspension and then just doing the converter too. Like in the bottle, instead of it trying to lug it down as bad, it just lets it sit there and sing so well right there. It was perfect. Like this yeah. truck is so well dialed in. I can't, yeah, I could I'm hear so what happy. you're getting out of it. Like you, you a little bit? Oh, yeah. Yeah, but I never had to get like way, way out of it. I just had to back out enough. And then right. once I kind of got it pitched right and roll back into it, Went right where I wanted it to go, so that was sick. Do you think the bigger tires in the front helped? Definitely. Like every upgrade we did helped. I, I yeah. guarantee it. Like this truck from three weeks ago at the Freedom Factory to right now is worlds better of a brand new. Good. Yeah, um, I was so happy. I was just so nervous. I didn't want to go out and get stuck against the I wall know. or hurt something or break something, and then everything went so well. That was awesome. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. It's fast, but I've worked everything and the truck steered yeah. super well. Exactly what you want. Yep. Yeah, I worked it out, have good speed coming in and everything. Approaching the burnout pit. Get your oh yeah, oh, oh, hold on. tons of smoke. Get your plugs. Get your plugs. Smoke. <laughs> Amazing 100 psi oil pressure the whole time, just absolutely shreds the tires, didn't hit the wall. So, I'm feeling good about that. One more time, let's hear it for our girl, Moore Burn. All right, well, that, Dude, that thing rips. That thing's nasty, huh? Somebody stole the dang burnout truck. Who is it? Oh, hi. Hi. All right, slap them on there. <laughs> get our drive tires back on so we can get it loaded up. Cooked them pretty good. This one just barely. I thought it was gone earlier, but it must have de-beat it, and then it came apart and then popped. So still worked out. All right, so with the lowering and everything, let's see how close this thing is to the ground. Not bad. We, uh, we're not sitting completely on the rim, but it looks, looks like we got plenty of room back here, so that's, that's perfect. Shoot, sure, that's what I'm talking about. All right. Stoked that Bernie's back to popping tires, huh, Ben? Yes, very much. We're back to popping tires, so down for a minute, looking but good out there, looking babe. good. Looking good. A lot good. of control. A lot of control. Quick tire pops. Probably need to find the right set of tires now. Uh, we'll 
feet's great, but we definitely need to find maybe a little bit bigger, wider. I don't know, something lasts a little bit longer. We are loaded up. The truck is ready to go. The crowd here at Indy was amazing. Cletus cars, again, never disappoints. And the truck did awesome. I couldn't be any happier with Bernie. Bernie just crushed it, killed two tires fast. We've still got some fine tuning to do, and we'll make it even better so we can get another win soon. But until next time, guys, see you later.